A short splice can be used in place of a knot to join two ropes, or the ends of the same rope, together. If two ropes are being joined with a short splice, they should be the same type of rope and have the same diameter. The short splice is a joining thing. It's actually better than a knot because it makes the rope stronger. Now to do this, we have to unwrap these four or five inches. That's it on that one. And the same thing on the other one. What we're going to try to do is we're going to try to set them together. Take the three strands and you know, like weave them. Normally I just hold the one side with my hand, but this time I'm going to use a twister seal to hold it in the center. Some people even take a piece of uh, waxed string and I'll put a whipping in there to hold it. I'm going to start with this one right here. It's going to go over this one that's right next to it and under this one. So I'm going to take it and put it under there. As with all splices, the tucking process consists of carefully going over the nearest strand and then under the next. I'm going to do that same process one more time. So I'm going to go over this one and under this one. And here I go. I'm going to go over this one and under this one. Okay, I'm going over this one and under that one. Now I've done it twice in this direction. I am going to flip the rope over and I'm going to start working the other direction. So we're going to go over this one and under this one. So I work my left hand by opening it up and I slide it in there. Okay. And this one's next, this one right here. It's going to go over this one and under this one. So my left hand will come and open this up and my right hand will take it through. Okay. And the third one sometimes hides on you. It's this. It's going to go over this one right here and under that one. So I move my left hand, I open it up. With my right hand, I put it through the hole. Okay, now that was twice that way. You can choose to taper the splice on both sides by snipping off some of the fibers from the ends of each strand. Now I've trimmed all six of them. Now I'm going to go back in here, pull it tight, and then twist it a little bit. And we look where we're going to go with this again, over this one and under that one. Okay, so I use my left hand to open this up by twisting it. And on my right hand, I put it through the loop, through the hole. Okay, and then I can go to the other end, on the other side. And I've already trimmed it, so all I have to find out it's over this one and under that one. There it is. Let me roll it helps to pack it in there. Now what I would do then is I would come in here and trim this stuff off. That's basically how you do a short splice.